today we're gonna replace the spark plugs and the coils on a Saab 9-3 model year 2004. The procedure is the same for model, model year 2003 all the way through 2011. So first we're gonna remove uh, the cover here. Okay, so once you remove this, you get access to the spark plug coils. And the car actually has a problem. Um, there's an error code. So, you know, possible problems are the coils, one of the plugs, or uh, one of the possible problems is this ionization module that you see over here. Next, we're gonna remove the, the coils. Just untightening them here. And I'm using for that the 10 millimeter socket. Right, so now we're going to disconnect the connectors here for each of the coils. You simply lift the uh, lift this piece here and then you push the connector off. And you do the same here, but let's go one by one. So here's the first coil, second coil, third coil. Here you go, the last coil. And now next we're gonna remove the coils that are, the spark plugs that are in here. So this is a 5 8 socket that I'm using. It's not the one that would have the little rubber piece in it. So I'll have to improvise a little bit to get the spark plug out, but. So that's the first spark plug. Okay, so the replacement spark plugs are the NGKs. This is the particular model that's used in the vehicle. And you know, check check the gap on the spark plug before you install it. Okay, so we're gonna I'm slowly putting them in, so there you go. So just Okay, so now we're going to tighten the plugs to 20 foot pounds here. And now we're gonna just put in the replacement spark plug coils in. So here are the replacement spark plug coils. This is the old one. Apparently what I'm seeing online is that the old ones tend to fail. So here's a replacement one with the part number. And uh, all you do is push them on and then you just use the bolts to, to secure them.
last one's on. Second one's on. Third one's on. And the last one, and now we can just put the, the bolts in. Just hand tighten them. And then the last piece, we're gonna put the cover on and just secure it with the four bolts. Right, and that completes the job.